Although I consider myself a sucker for visual novels, I don't mind when developers try new things with the genre. With this in mind, I found myself drawn to the Emerald Tablet, a crafting RPG visual novel hybrid that borrows elements from the popular Atelier series. The game focuses on its story elements and characters, which don't make the biggest impact. Instead, it's the mix of RPG systems included that make it worth checking out. The Emerald Tablet introduces Misty, a girl who happens to have the dream of becoming an alchemist. Sadly, the academy she applied to raised the fees to an incredibly high amount that she couldn't afford. In hopes of gaining the funds needed, she turns to her friend Gladys, who happens to be reasonably wealthy. When Gladys is in the picture, we are introduced to her mysterious maid Winnie, who has a fascination with bombs. However, Misty has a bit more to worry about as she is tasked with reaching a high enough reputation which requires her to craft items. On top of that, if she doesn't manage to pay back her debt before graduating, she will need to work as a maid for Gladys. The Emerald Tablet features some comedic elements in its story delivery, mixed with light-hearted bits of character development. Each day, the story shows Misty interacting with her friends as they get into a rather silly situation. I ended up looking forward to these moments since Misty and her friends are pretty hilarious, and I enjoyed learning more about them. But the game focuses heavily on its crafting systems. You begin by crafting in Misty's workshop with the items you've bought or collected. Each item varies and stats as you combine them to create new ones. While crafting, you can create items that you've learned throughout the adventure, but there's also a menu that allows you to craft entirely new ones. The gameplay features here are what I found to be the most entertaining aspect. During gameplay, you have access to a menu-based map that allows you to select your next destination. Figuring out how to progress the narrative is also neatly organized on the menu so you don't feel too lost. Since earning money is the main point of the game, these jobs are essential to get out of debt. The quests range from simple ones like donating and delivering certain items, or quests with a bit more thought put behind them, such as crafting a specific item for someone. Throughout the game, you'll complete many quests which made it tedious to have to go to the quest board to accept each reward, every time. Some quests have you battle by visiting a dungeon. Dungeons can also be used to collect items. Quests and exploration also come with a time limit in which the game features three different difficulty settings that make it easier. Through battles, characters can unlock new skills and become stronger by using talent points. I enjoyed how many abilities each character can learn and how they each filled an essential role in my party. I found an appreciation for the various illustrations given to the characters, including the dungeon crawling chibi designs. The game does a great job of showing the emotions of the characters through their illustrations, which was nice considering that there isn't any voiced audio in the game. The Emerald Tablet is a lovely and lighthearted JRPG that I had a good amount of fun playing. The characters are lively, cute, and quirky, which was well represented in their dialogue. The game loop revolves around selecting quests, traveling through dungeons, and crafting items with the hope of one day getting out of debt. Although the theme of debt isn't powerful enough to make for a deep narrative adventure, but seeing Misty follow her dream is sufficient reason to see the quest through until the end. The crafting systems end up becoming the most significant appeal of this adventure in the later hours, which worked fine for me. Pixel is giving the Emerald Tablet a 7.5 out of 10. Thank you for watching. Please read the full review at NoisyPixel.net. NoisyPixel is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all our future content.